Oh God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Alleluia. In this our bright and paschal day, the sun shines out with purer ray. When Christ to earthly sight made plain, the glad apostles see again. The wounds, the riven wounds he shows, in that his flesh with light that glows. In loud accord, both far and nigh, the Lord's arising testify. O Christ, the King who loves to bless, to you our hearts and souls possess. To you our praise that we may pay, to whom our Lord is due for air. Amen. Have courage, my son. Your sins are forgiven. Alleluia. Have mercy on me, God, in your kindness. In your compassion blot out my offense. Oh, wash me more and more from my guilt and cleanse me from my sin. My offenses, truly I know them. My sin is always before me. Against you, you alone have I sinned. What is evil in your sight I have done? That you may be justified when you give sentence and be without reproach when you judge. Oh, see, in guilt I was born. A sinner was I conceived. Indeed, you love truth in the heart. Then, in the secret of my heart, teach me wisdom. O oh, purify me, then I shall be clean. O、oh, wash me, I shall be whiter than snow. Make me hear rejoicing and gladness. That the bones you have crushed may revive. From my sins, turn away your face, and blot out all my guilt. A pure heart create for me, O God. Put a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence. Nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit. Give me again the joy of your help. With a spirit of fervor, sustain me, that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. O、oh, rescue me, God, my helper. And my tongue shall ring out your goodness, O Lord. Open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For in sacrifice you take no delight; burnt offering from me you would refuse. My sacrifice, a contrite spirit. A humbled, contrite heart you will not spur. In your goodness, show favor to Zion. Rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. Then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, holocausts offered on your altar. Gloria Patria et Filio. Et spiritui sancto, 
Sicuterat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Have courage, my son. Your sins are forgiven. Alleluia. You go forth to save your people, to save your anointed one. Alleluia. O Lord, I have heard your renown and feared, O Lord, your work. In the course of the years, revive it. In the course of the years, make it known. In your wrath, remember compassion. God comes from Taman, the Holy One from Mount Paran. Covered are the heavens with his glory, and with his praise the earth is filled. His splendor spreads like the light. Rays shine forth from beside him, where his power is concealed. You come forth to save your people, to save your anointed one. You tread the sea with your steeds, amid the churning of the deep waters. I hear and my body trembles, at the sound my lips quiver. Decay invades my bones, my legs tremble beneath me. I await the day of distress that will come upon the people who attack us. For though the fig tree blossom not, nor fruit be on the vines, though the yield of the olive fail, and the terraces produce no nourishment, though the flocks disappear from the fold, and there be no herd in the stalls. Yet I will rejoice in the Lord and exult in my saving God. God my Lord is my strength. He makes my feet swift as those of hinds and enables me to go upon the heights. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Sicut erat in principio, et nunc, et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. You go forth to save your people, to save your anointed one. Alleluia. Zion. Give praise to your God. He has brought peace to your borders. Alleluia. O praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Zion, praise your God. He has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed the children within you. He established peace on your Borders, he feeds you with finest wheat. He sends out his word to the earth and swiftly runs his command. He showers down snow white as a wool. He scatters hoar frost like ashes. He hurls down hailstones like crumbs. The waters are frozen at his touch. He sends forth his word, and it melts them. At the breath of his mouth the waters flow. He makes his word known to Jacob, to Israel his laws and decrees. He has not dealt thus with other nations. He has not taught them his decrees. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Zion, give praise to our God. 
He has brought peace to your borders. Alleluia. The God of our fathers has raised up Jesus, whom you put to death, hanging him on a tree. He whom God has exalted at his right hand as ruler and savior is to bring repentance to Israel and forgiveness of sins. We testify to this. So too does the Holy Spirit, whom God has given to those that obey him. The Lord is risen from the tomb. Alleluia, Alleluia. He hung upon the cross for us. Alleluia, Alleluia. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. The Lord is risen from the tomb. Alleluia, Alleluia. Jesus took bread, and when he had given thanks, he gave it to those who were at table with him. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Jesus took bread, and when he had given thanks, he gave it to those who were at table with him, Alleluia. God the Father raised up Christ through the Spirit and will also raise up our mortal bodies. Let us cry out to him. Lord, raise us to life through your Holy Spirit. All Holy Father, you accepted the holocaust of your Son in raising him from the dead. Accept the offering we make today and lead us to eternal life. Look with favor on all we do today, that it may be for your glory and the sanctification of the world. May our work today not be in vain, but for the good of the whole world, and through it lead us to your kingdom. Open our eyes today to recognize our brothers and sisters and our hearts to love them so that we may love and serve each other. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, 
as we forgive those who trespass against us, and to lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. O God, hope and light of the sincere, we humbly entreat you to dispose our hearts to offer you worthy prayer, and ever to extol you by dutiful proclamation of your praise. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. 